Hey, what is going on guys? Got a little Windows 10 uh, tip for you here today. So in May, they released a pretty big update with you know a little design tweak here and there. So I was going to try and get that. And typically in Windows, you know, updates are installed automatically. You can't really do nothing about it until they get here. So I wanted the May 2019 update. But when I went to my update status, I just had typical normal Windows updates that were available. I didn't have any of the uh, you know latest and greatest May 2019 update, and that update is named 1903. So you can see this is just uh, 1803, and it's even 17. This is a virtual machine, and I installed a um, older version, so I had several updates to install but I didn't have the one I was looking for. So how do you get the 2019 update? Well, you can actually manually install this update yourself and I'm gonna show you how to do that. All right, so it's really simple. All you gotta do is go to Google and type in Windows 10 May 2019 update. I'll put a link in the description to this site whenever it comes up here. And the very first link that comes up is gonna be the get the Windows 10 update so you go ahead and click on that and this is a Microsoft support link and you're gonna get this page right here and if you notice this line if 1903 isn't offered automatically you can get it through the update assistant so you want to click on the update assistant link right here and again I'll put a link straight to this page it's about to come up just so you guys don't have to you know go through everything that I just went through but if you want to you can and you can see right here the first link is the update assistant so you go ahead and click on the update now button right here when you click on that link it's going to install the uh, update assistant so just wait for that to install here alright guys so when the update assistant opens up it'll say update to the latest version of Windows 10 and it says it will update to the 1903 which is the one that we want so all you gotta do is click the update now button and it is going to uh, check your device for compatibility and you can see we're good to go here so you can go ahead and hit next and it is now going to get the update ready download it and uh, do everything it needs to do so whenever this gets done I will come back all right so now it is verifying our download and now it is updating all right guys it's finally gotten done got done a little while ago it started counting down but uh, we can go ahead and restart now and this should get everything installed for us all right so we are updating uh, we're going through several different updating screens and restarting and all that so Still taking a while, come back whenever it gets done. All right guys, so finally we are here on the desktop. It says thank you for updating. You can go ahead and click on the exit and you can see we're finally on the desktop. So you can see we have some of the new stuff uh, in here and it looks slightly different. We even have a different uh, wallpaper. And if we go into our settings, go into personalization here, and if we click on the colors, we can uh, choose the Windows mode here and we can actually see the new light mode. So there's what that looks like. So yeah, that is how you update to the latest and greatest Windows May update. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. And I'll catch you all in the next one.